Hey friends, welcome back to another whole house clean with me. This is actually my first whole house clean with me in the new house. So I'm super excited for this video. It was actually kind of fun doing this because I'm used to cleaning the condo, but today it's all about cleaning the new house. And so if you guys are in the mood for some cleaning motivation or just want to see kind of how things look throughout the house, get ready, today is a good video. I also wanted to thank HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. Make sure to use my code KatieSatilli12 to get up to 12 free meals across your four boxes with HelloFresh. So visit the link in my description box for more details. I also wanted to invite you if you're new here to make sure you hit that red subscribe button and don't forget to hit the little bell for notifications. That way you can see anytime I upload new videos and you can be part of the subscriber community here. It's super fun. I do lots of vlogs and cleaning videos and sometimes like Target or Walmart try-ons. We just do kind of whatever we're inspired to do at the moment. So make sure you stick around, hit that red subscribe button. So today I'm just gonna be starting off in the kitchen. We had some dishes left over from lunch and we have like a thousand sippy cups everywhere just because the kids tend to get themselves like multiple cups throughout the day. So um, I just wanted to get all that stuff put away. There was a lot of crumbs on the countertops. You couldn't really see it, but there was like just it had been a couple days since I wiped them down like completely. So I'm going to give everything like a good reset just so that I can kind of feel better and get started with the rest of my cleaning. So I opened my fridge just to pick out what I was going to make for lunch and I decided on this Yucatan citrus chicken bowls from HelloFresh and it was such a good meal. Seriously, they never fail to impress me. I always love the meals that I get from HelloFresh. They are so unique and creative or sometimes it's like an old faithful type of recipe like we got sloppy joes in the meals that we got. So I just love like how good <laughs> their meals are. I'm serious. I love that I don't have to plan out my meals for the week because I don't like doing that. It's probably one of my least favorite things to do, even though it makes my life run so much smoother. But oh my gosh, you guys, this meal was insane. So basically I'm just starting off with chopping up the citrus and it was so good. I've never cooked with so much citrus in my life. So HelloFresh offers so many recipes to choose from each week and it helps to break you out of your recipe rut. So I just love that. I hate making the same meals over and over every week. So this is like perfect for me. I just love trying new things, but I tend to just get lazy and not look up recipes. So it just makes my heart happy that HelloFresh does the work for me. So HelloFresh cuts out stressful meal planning and prepping so you can enjoy the cooking part and get dinner on the table in just about 30 minutes. They even have the quick and easy option and that takes about 20 minutes, which is super awesome especially for us mamas who are trying to make a meal as fast as possible. It's just so nice that they have a quick option. So HelloFresh's pre-portioned ingredients mean there's less prep for you and less wasted food. I also love how everything comes like perfectly organized and labeled. So 
I am just an organized type person, so I feel like having everything perfectly portioned out and labeled just makes my heart so happy. Also with HelloFresh, you can add extra dinners or lunches to your weekly order. So you could throw in extra proteins or add in yummy meal compliments like HelloFresh's best-selling garlic bread. Mmm, I think my mouth just started watering. <laughs> I love that. You can easily change your delivery days or food preferences and skip a week whenever you need. Also, HelloFresh is committed to giving back. They donated over two and a half million meals to charity in 2019, and this year is stepping up their food donations amid the coronavirus crisis. So make sure to use my code KDSATILLI12 to get up to 12 free meals across your four boxes with HelloFresh. Make sure you visit the link in my description box for more details. And can we just talk for a second about how delicious this meal was? OMG, I was like plating it all up and putting the sauce on top and adding a lime wedge and I just plated up the rice and the chicken and the veggies and then on top I'm putting the pickled onions and then I'm gonna put some cilantro on top and it was divine like so good Sean and I scarfed it up we had seconds it was <laughs> super yummy. So make sure you check out my description box to try some for yourself. So we actually had a parent meeting while we were eating our dinner. So um, <laughs> I finished the parent meeting and Sean actually went in and cleaned up the entire kitchen. <laughs> so uh, I, I saw him doing it as he was doing it and I was like, oh, I'm filming a cleaning video. But then I was like, oh, you know, I have so much to do. I'm just going to let this happen. So Sean cleaned up all the dishes from dinner and I did not get it on film, but I just wanted to do like a thorough wipe down of the whole countertops. So I did that. Um, but we definitely did not get footage of cleaning up the dishes. So also, side note, if you're wondering, my kids are going back to school um, in a cohort. So if you've been following me now for a while, you know how um, hard the distance learning thing has been for us. It's just been a lot of work, but um, the kids are finally able to go back to school, which they're only going back to school Monday and Tuesday mornings. And then Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, they are still gonna be doing distance learning from the house. So that is just a family life update for the Satillis. So now that the kitchen is pretty much cleaned up, I'm going to just head into the living room and pick up some of the toys and blankets and stuff like that that were just thrown all over the place. <laughs> I will say, I think I said it in the beginning of this video, but it was really interesting filming this cleaning video because like I said, I am used to cleaning the condo only, um, but this is like... It's not three times as much space, but it's like two and a half times as much space as the condo was. So I was just kind of like taken back by the amount of time it takes to clean this much space. I knew it was going to take longer, but then when you actually do it, it's just kind of like trippy. Anyways, so right now I am going to be filling up my O Cedar Spin Mop and um, I'm just gonna be mopping the floors. I'm using Pine Sol, the lemon scent. I tried the other Pine Sol, the original scent, and I don't care for it, but um, yeah, this is like a good one.
So I try to work from the top down. So if I need to wipe surfaces off, I try to do all of that first and then I do the floors. So that's kind of like my method that I was trying to go for. And so now I'm just grabbing the Dyson and I'm going to be vacuuming up all the crumbs. I have tried to get into the habit of vacuuming the floors every afternoon. I feel like it just, I don't know, the crumbs and you know, our backyard is not finished. So every time the kids come in and out, the dirt comes in and yeah. So I just have tried to make it a habit to vacuum my house every afternoon. excited because the weather is warming up here over the next week um, it has been in like the 60s but 60s or 70s but I see the calendar shows on the weather app that we're supposed to be heading into a week that's like closer to the 80s which I'm really excited about because I just love like being outside when it's that kind of temperature and having like the windows open and all that stuff. So let me know down in the comments where you're at and what the weather's like right now. I'm pretty sure it's warming up for most of the country, but I'm not absolutely sure. So I know it sounds kind of funny, but I actually really enjoyed mopping the floors. I feel like it just feels so fresh and clean when you're done and it smells really fresh because it's the lemon scent and I had the kids go upstairs with Sean. Um, so it was kind of like a therapeutic, like Zen moment. I know it sounds kind of funny cause you're like, Katie, you're cleaning. But at the same time, it's like, just getting everything to look pretty and like a fresh slate. And it was, I had like country music playing and it was quiet down there. So anyways, I really enjoyed mopping the floors. So this was later on in the day and Fiona had finished her schoolwork and so I wanted to get the table all picked up and I'm not gonna lie, I always am tempted to just leave the stuff out because she's gonna be doing school the next day anyways, but uh, Sean and I both prefer <laughs> to just get everything cleared up and put away um, so it doesn't look as cluttered. So that's what I'm gonna be doing right now. So now I'm going to grab this Method wood cleaning spray and I'm going to be spraying down the dining room table. Now, this is my first time cleaning this table like this and I will say it did not work. <laughs> um, I feel like I'm going to be learning how to clean my house here on screen so I would love any tips that you guys have. Um, this table is a little bit rough on top. It's not like a completely smooth table, which I think is 
partly why I love how it looks, but at the same time, it's not like a smooth surface to wipe down. So I'm not exactly sure how I'm gonna be cleaning the whole thing. Maybe I should use a sponge. Maybe I should use, I don't know. Let me know down in the comments if you have any suggestions. I feel like the way the dining room turned out is exactly how I envisioned it in my mind when we were planning. So Sean and I used to sit around every Friday night and we would just dream of what our house would look like, you know, cause it was like a nine month process waiting for the house to be built. So we knew it was coming. Um, so we would just literally sit and talk through like, okay, we want to plant here. We want this table here. We want this rug here. I don't know. We just would sit around and dream constantly of how we wanted the house to look. So having it all together just makes me so happy. And like all of our ideas kind of like coming to life. I loved doing that. So anyways, the dining room is basically done. And now we're going to be moving on to the office. So over here on the windowsill, I don't know if you can see it, but there's like fingerprints and like dust and dirt and stuff. And the kids love to, oh, and there's like toe prints down here. <laughs> um, the kids love to look out this window at like the diggers and the tractors and the backhoes and all the things. Cause you know, our whole entire neighborhood is being built up right now. So they have like a fun entertaining show to watch every time they look out the window but um also when people come over if we're waiting for them they'll like pull up a chair and sit right there at the windowsill anyways they get their little like cheesy paw prints all over <laughs> the wall so i knew i wanted to wipe those down now i'm just vacuuming out um, the office like i said i do this every day um, I do like just a quick vacuum. I feel like it just gets up all of like the little pieces of stuff that fall. And can we just take a moment to talk about my chair? Okay, I wasn't sure. I was scared to get this chair because it's quite the statement piece, but you guys have kind of helped me realize that it was a good call to get this chair because um, I can see on the back end with my links how many clicks different things get and I can see how many items people have bought and by far this chair has been the highest purchase out of anything in the entire house so let me know down in the comments if you're one of the people who bought the chair I am so thankful when you guys buy through my links because I do get a small commission which I'm super thankful for but I loved that other people liked that chair as well because I was kind of nervous to buy it in the beginning just because I felt like, you know, it's kind of like a big statement, but I really love how it turned out.
So as I'm cleaning Hudson's potty chair, I am just realizing the work that needs to be done. He was almost fully potty trained before we moved into this house. And then like moving week came and we just were lazy and kept putting diapers on him basically. And so yeah, bad news is I need to potty train him again. But the good news is he knows how to do it. I just have to be disciplined and put him back in underwear. So um, the kids go back to school in a couple of weeks. I think I'm going to start trying then because then I can have like a little bit more time to focus on just Hudson. So now we're moving upstairs and I took my sweater off because I was getting kind of hot, but I am going to be vacuuming the carpet in almost every room upstairs. We're not going to be going in Fiona's room just because I'm planning on doing a video for her room. We're going to be doing some wallpapering soon. We already have the wallpaper. It's from Etsy. Um, so stay tuned for that video. Make sure you're subscribed with your notifications turned on. Um, cause that will be coming up and I'm really excited about it. Uh, but for now I am just going to be moving this huge clean laundry pile so that I can vacuum my floors. So today is a Friday and I'm so excited to be at the end of the week. I love when we get to Friday because I feel like very accomplished. We got through all of the school days and you know it's the weekend. We can have time to relax and all that stuff. So um, I'm just excited about that. My aunt is coming over to visit. She comes on Fridays and does like crafts and stuff with the kids, which is super fun. And then we are having a couple of friends over tonight for dinner. And I'm really excited because I'm going to be making one of our Hello Fresh meals for them, which is going to be fun because I feel like there's always kind of this pressure to like impress people <laughs> with your cooking when they come over for dinner. But um, I feel like using my hello fresh meals it will be impressive <laughs> so i'm excited to have these people over also have you guys seen my closet makeover video so i actually just posted it this morning and it's doing really bad so in the analytics we can see how our videos are doing how it scores compared to other videos that we've posted recently so this one is scoring a 10 out of 10 which i'm like so disappointed because i was really excited about the closet video but that's okay i will not everyone can be a winner video right 
some videos are just bound to do not as well but it's funny because you just never know which videos will do well and which videos won't do well um so anyways but i'm really excited about how my closet turned out so if you haven't watched that video make sure you check it out in um my channel links so yeah anyways and if you have seen it let me know what you thought of it down in the comments So I'm just finishing up by vacuuming the stairs and this is something that I actually don't really enjoy doing but it definitely needed to be done this day. So I just wanted to say a big thank you if you made it this far in the video. Don't forget to check out all my HelloFresh links and coupon code down in the description box and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.